past two days at Mesa were thrilling, grilling, and they were sleepless as well. Honestly, I can't say that my favorite part. The two days have been very special. We were building on the AI hackathon where we had to build our AI model as well as our business revenue model. But I came here and we had a two-hour rigorous session, which gave me a very good head start and a very good insight into what AI is and how easy it is to actually learn such things. A hackathon is never a foolproof kind of an exercise. We wanted to give our students a flavor of what this building is going to look like. It's going to be fast-paced. It's going to be rigorous. It is going to be high agency from their end. They are going to have to think a lot. In those two hours, the the brief that was given to them was that I'm I'm going to teach them a tool which is called Relevance AI. It's a tool that can be used to build agents from scratch. Uh, the the reason behind doing that was to again you know give them that confidence that hey you know even I can sit in a classroom and build something from scratch. And I think that's what it did. You know when they built this, there was this aha moment that wow it took us just one and a half hours and we have created something of value for for some customers at least. We wanted them to work in teams, come up with uh, some solid problems that they can target for customers, build some. Something real from scratch, demo it, and have an ad that can reach out to customers. Now, at the end of this, the incentive for them was that they get to pitch to VCs. Right now, we are working on an AI agent that will use alternative financing data to assess the credit worthiness of small-scale business owners and farmers. But I would say we're working in the college application space. Imagine there's this uh, AI which can fill all your college applications together at the same time. I'm very excited because they ask us to first prepare a pitch, and second, we need to make a video ad. Yeah, Warren's session was uh, pretty rigorous. Um, a lot to cover in two hours, but it was amazing. Uh, what I would I wouldn't have learned maybe in a week, we learned in two hours. It was pretty good. When we gave this challenge to students, we were expecting the the level of ideas to be good, but not real life applications. But the depth to which these students went. I mean, there were folks who were thinking about how to build an AI agent that clears out hiring funnels. Uh, there was an agent that was built that used to create uh, recipes on the basis of what your health goals are. It was that we are talking about and I was very impressed. So among the pitches that I saw that I can broadly categorize into two. There were few students who were building uh, consumer AI companies and there were few who were building enterprise SaaS AI companies. Just the thoughtfulness with which they had built the product and the early prototype they had got to, which was working uh, well, had impressed me a lot. I think, uh, I think there are two things that I am very excited about. One is, uh, in year one itself, they'll be doing two things. That is, they, they, they will be building an AI product and they will be building a D2C brand. And I think the muscles that they will build while they are doing these two things will be very different, but yet very important. In the world of AI, I think the two most important things that are going to matter is build and sell. You need to be able to build a product, sell the product. So building is all going to be about this AI product. Selling is going to be this G2C brand where we will be giving them rupees 1 lakh in debt and they'll need to grow that 1 lakh to 5 lakh rupees. And I think building these two muscles in year one uh, is going to set them up for success. And I'm very excited about that. I see myself overcoming challenges or fears or understanding new ones. At the same time, I see myself being a founder to a good revenue building company. My, my excitement level on the scale of 1 to 10 would be absolutely 10 on 10. Already wearing the Mesa t-shirt, that shows my excitement. So I'm, you know, eager to join the batch on August.